Buenas tardes. Good afternoon, ministers, dear colleagues. I'd like to thank UNESCO for, for holding this pre-summit. It's an opportunity for us to talk about the transformative power of education. When talking about uh, Spain, we can talk about this new uh, reform that can help us address the challenges of the 21st century and a focus on the uh, SDGs, in particular SDG 4. We uh, responded quickly to the uh, national consultations and we've already got the first outcomes. First, continue uh, to pursue the educational reform that uh, highlights four aspects, developing skills, educate with uh, equal rights and values, uh, digital transformation, and promoting sustainability and well-being. Spain recently has passed a reform that uh, encompasses all of these aspects, and I'd like to give you, an, I'll give you some examples. Second, we need to improve the teaching profession. We need to count on teachers, we need their support. In our countries, we have put in place a reform of the teaching profession. The aim is to value the profession and improve their training uh, and promote their development throughout their career. It is essential to count on also universities. Third, the consultation reflects that we need uh, to include youth and we need to make our economies competitive. We need also uh, to um, promote uh, training and promote skills for work. And again, we will collaborate with universities. Spain has also passed a reform recently on vocational training that um, is something that, uh, as a society, we are really focusing on. Fourth and lastly, we need to focus on quality lifelong learning. In Spain, with vocational training and university, we're creating a um, different modules that uh, will work for lifelong learning. We're also counting on businesses so that we can all continue to learn throughout all stages of our lives without leaving anyone behind. It seems fundamental to me that we also need to listen to members of societies and we need to listen to teachers. So we will continue to reflect on this. I hope that this uh, consultation process will lead to outcomes that our president were able to share in the summit in New York. Thank you.